holy freaking cow, this keeps freezing and this is my last attempt at doing this or I'm just going to quit for today. So anyways, you guys might have seen me on winningdinnergame.com or the WGR.com, that's my sales team website. Um, the phrase, why does some person's life seem easier than mine or, or, or yours? And the reality is, is no one really has an easier or a harder life. We just all have a different life, a different experience, a different trial, challenge, whatever it is. And so each one of us goes through our life and because of we're literally a product of of where we come from the, the family that we grew up in the religion we attended the public school we attended the media that was on around our house and in our neighborhood that's what programmed us and so we just had our experiences <clears throat> today i was on a coaching call with one of my team members um, we were talking about not just making contacts, but actually scheduling appointments. And obviously, uh, contacts are required to set appointments. And one of the things that I had asked her is, okay, we've got the macro level of our of our goals, which is you know seventy five close transactions, five hundred thousand income, whatever it is, or or maybe it's you know to go on a vacation, do this or that. That's macro size. And then there's the micro size goals that we must visualize. And a lot of times, this is where people overlook creating the life that they want and that is for example in real estate are you visualizing yourself making your prospecting call are you visualizing yourself making you know doing a listing presentation and getting a yes at the end of it and, and getting a new client uh, you know you take a look at a gymnast I'm I don't watch a lot of gymnastics but from my experience in gymnastics and watching Olympic athletes usually they'll visualize doing the routine before they go out and do their their gymnastic tricks or a golfer. Most golfers, professional level golfers, were visualizing in their mind their shot, the exact stroke, how they're handing it, and, and just visualizing the ball going onto the green and into the cup. Bobsled, luge uh, you know, athletes in the Olympics, they will literally visualize going down the turns and the curves of the bobsledding course. And th it, that is taking the formless substance and then printing out in 3D in your real life. Sometimes how we plan it, it doesn't exactly happen out, uh, happen exactly how we plan it, which is good and bad. You know, it kind of sucks that we didn't get what we wanted, but usually there's just a little bit more that we get out of that that was just better for us at that time so that we could learn the lesson we needed to learn to get where we're going on the macro level. Because the macro level is really what we want to fulfill, but it's focusing on your micro uh, movements that are really really important are you going in de the devil in the de is in the details that's that's a phrase that I've heard for a long time the devil's in the details that works for you and against you against you because if you forget the the details but for you if you really focus on the details if you're really specific and really detail oriented in your mind what it is that you want to create in your life you'll be able to with time by making small little pivotal, pivotal adjustments, you'll be able to accomplish that. It's those small and, and, and simple steps that create the macro goal. So visualize on those small and simple steps. I hope you guys are getting value from some of the videos that I've done. Um, I've got a lot of you sending me emails, text messages, messages. I appreciate that. I just want to create value for you guys, empower you, and invite you to do the same to others. And that's what I found in my life has created an awesome amount of success for, for all my businesses and just my life and, and my family. So I want to be able to share that with others. Appreciate you guys. We'll see ya.